Hey, what is happening guys? Welcome back to my channel. My name is Blizzard Raptor. You found the channel where I play games and offer my humble opinion on games and it's all for your entertainment. If you are new here, hi, welcome to the channel. I'd like to please ask you to subscribe uh, and join the uh, over 100 people that have already subscribed and added their support to the channel. I have a goal of 500 before the end of the year, so if we could get 500 subs and build ourselves a nice wee community, that'd be fantastic. Also like this video and leave a comment down below, it can be about anything gaming or it can be about Fallout 4 and the DLC in particular. And let's crack on with a moral combat. So, we've... We've done quite a bit of a Nuka world. We've explored, we've seen the outside the main park. There are a few, I imagine there's quite a lot up here that I haven't seen yet. Uh, but we've seen quite a few places, <clears throat> filled out the map a little. We're gonna do a couple of the Radiant quests today. I'm hoping that the Operators and Disciples quests are better. If they're not, then I'll be seriously tempted to just kill people. What's come up here? Well, that requires pre-war money. Is this fetch? Oh, it is. I heard you were looking for me. You heard the alarm, right? That means someone's in the gauntlet. Looks like a real tough one, too. What happens next is up to you. You can take him on yourself in the arena, or I can make sure our little rat never gets out of the maze. <sighs> Time to put on a show. Hell yeah! No better way to earn a raider's respect than kicking some ass in front of a crowd. Just head for the arena whenever you're ready, boss. So I can't get tokens out the dispenser unless I get pre-war money. Just gonna have a quick look around. Because I've got tickets for the Starcade. And use... Oh, wait a minute. Here we go. I don't have any tickets. I thought that was the thing. Oh, have I been putting them all in the... Because they're junk, I'll have been putting them all in the... Junk pile when I've been collecting them. Give me a second, let me just check. That they've not went under miss. No, there's Nuka K tickets. So what do I use the new Cacade tickets for then? I can take all of them and use them for... It's one of the worst weapons in the game, the Kami Whacker. I'll need to find out what all those tickets are used for then. Because I've found like, big rolls of them. I was kind of hoping it was just going to be as simple as walking up to that machine and using them there. Let's. Wouldn't hurt to tip the scales a little in our favor. Yeah. I mean, I've tipped the scales in no one's favor. I've tried to be even, although the operators and disciples have more territory than the uh, the pack, which is why the pack are kind of pissed off with me. Thank you. 
Yeah. That's not what I wanted to do at all. Combat armor stuff I can sell. Stealth boys, stem packs. Yeah, we'll sell all this shit. It had a skull. Now, normally the skull icon means that I. that I can't take them, that they're difficult, beyond my level, but. That guy disintegrated. Sure, we carry guns, but knives wear that. It's not fun in this world. Well, hello there, young fella. Welcome to Nuka World. I'm Mira, your friendly Nuka World informational robotic assistant. Is this your first visit to Nuka World? As a matter of fact, it is. Well, that's terrific. We're so happy to welcome you to Nuka World. Now, before you set off on your grand Nuka adventure, let me tell you about error. <laughs> System malfunction. Are you finished wasting my time, you filthy lowlife scabber? Because I'm getting bored, and when I get bored, I get violent. You are clearly suffering from some kind of major malfunction. The only malfunction I've got is this idiot scabber standing in front of me. Maybe I should solve my little problem permanently. System restored. Oops, sorry about that little glitch. Data logs indicate unauthorized tampering with my personality subroutines. Please contact a Nuka World maintenance technician as soon as possible. What happened? Who was tampering with you? I wish I could say. The personnel involved do not match visual records of any known Nuka World employees. Fortunately, my audio receptors recorded the entire event, and I submitted a holotape per standard security procedures. Now don't you worry. Even despite that unfortunate incident, I'm still operating at well over 61% normal capacity. As I was about to say, I have a little tip to help you make the most of your exciting Nuka World <laughs> adventure. Be sure to collect park medallions as you enjoy our amazing rides and attractions. There's a special reward if you collect a full set. If you have any questions about Nuka World, I'd be delighted to answer them. And remember, any time is the right time to enjoy a cold, refreshing Nuka Cola. No questions for now. In that case, thanks for error. <laughs> System malfunction. You're still here? Get the hell out of my face, you miserable dung sniffing dirt scratcher. System restored. Have a great day. Okay, somebody's been messing with Nita. <laughs> Find Don't someone I can I'll sell see. all my stuff to, probably, you know, yeah, this guy. Here to stock up, we're just making the rounds. Sure, let's take a look. All right. I want to sell you this. Plus this and that and that. Alright, let's check out what the other two factions have. We 
We've already done one of the PAX quests. They want me to do another. The PAX quests seem to be the ones involving going out and shoving collars on people, which is not something I'm really keen to do. We'll do some operator stuff. Hopefully that'll be a bit better. Uh, no. I thought about trying my hand. Not supposed to hurt the other gangs. No rule against tricking them into hurting. Scavers. Scaver. Mags, William, and Lizzie. Waster. Operator. Sure as hell we're born for it. Never did get why Coulter brought in three gang to claim Nuka World. Max. He had us. Don't need the rest. William. I'm looking for Lizzie. Lizzie! Hey there. There are some sick minds running around Nuka World. All the more important you back us. Coulter's pushing up daisies. It's a lovely gift. But I think there are others our gang would like more. New territory, maybe? Lizzie. So much money spent on this place. Just to hock some soda. Sad, don't you think? Okay, so I can't do anything with her at the moment. That sucks a little. Hey, Lizzie. <sighs> I always thought the parlor was a bit garish. But Mags and William have taken a shine to it, and two Trump won, I guess. I'll never grasp the allure of the other gangs. Nothing but targets with fur and trash piles with attitude. Hey. If you're here looking to wreak a little havoc, I think I can provide. Up for some work. Your wish is my command. Glad to hear it. There's a favor I need done. And old friend would like a rival taught a lesson apply this shock collar to her if you can do it without being detected wonderful otherwise feel free to pummel her into agreement i think i'm gonna enjoy that good to hear we'll be waiting ah so they're all just the same really you know i'm not convinced it's a bit but shit. I'll see if the disciples have got one that I can pick up as well. I'll do these three radiants and then I'm just gonna do the main quest. I'm only do uh, I'm even gonna bother doing the radiants. We'll see if this is gonna be a radiant quest. If it's not, if it's something decent, I might consider actually doing it. If not, I think I'm just gonna go on and do the main story. Leaving us hanging? Damn new funks. Stuck in our head again. So this is one time, long time ago. I'm enjoying myself, you know, out in the combat zone. A few beds. Afraid of a little commitment. A whole lot of jokes. I'm making friends, having a good time. Now this one guy, he gets jealous. I mean, I can't blame You've got Territory, I've given you all territory. Come on, you know our side has not sure what Nisha sees in decides he's gonna challenge me to a drinking contest. I'm not sure what's worse. Wearing a tie or wearing a teddy bear. Nisha seems to think you can make a difference. Where is your boss? Be up the top of this, isn't she? Yeah, looks like it. I take a minute to make sure that I'm not so drunk that I'm just 
Always keep your knife sharp. I hope they weren't gauntlet runners. Dixie? Another named. Nisha! If you side with the disciples, the whole Commonwealth will fear us. And with fear comes power. Nisha. Not busy? I could use you. Whatever I can do to help. Well, aren't you agreeable? I was just thinking about our dear friends in the pack. Some wastelanders selling secrets about us, but not for long. Just don't make it too quick. It's more satisfying when suffering is involved. Right up my alley. Good. So all of their quests are tracked. So I think we'll just do go back to doing the main the main stuff because to be fair these aren't these aren't great. I could do these for anybody. These are like minute main quests, so let's find Shank. What a name for a character as well, especially in a gang. Shank. Damn Nuka Cola song stuck in my head again. Overboss. Making trouble? He is inside the market somewhere, I think. Or maybe he's outside it, actually. Yeah, here we go. Hey, I just wanted to say, well, no hard feelings. Look who it is. Liking what you've done with the place, boss. Gangs certainly seem pleased with their new little kingdoms. I haven't seen people this revved up since last time someone spiked the water fountains. Never formally introduced myself. Name Shank. And if you're standing here, well, I suppose Gage figured you might be the one to finally get things back on track. How long it take him to convince you it was time to move on the Commonwealth? Sounded like a good idea. Because it is. Giving the gang spots to call their own around the park, it bought you some goodwill. But providing them with their own domains, carved from the settlements of the Commonwealth, well, I can't think of a better way to solidify your place around here. Plus, make us all a pretty penny along the way. If that interests you, well, all you've got to do is say the word, and we can let the fun begin. Okay. Let's get started. Music to my ears. Okay, I fully bought into so the radar. So getting us set up in the Commonwealth is going to require three things. Territory, provisions, and loyalty. First things first. Territory. We're going to need to claim a settlement for our gang to work from. An outpost. And there are two ways to claim new territory. You can head in yourself and <laughs> convince the locals to leave. Or I can get a crew together and you all can put them in the dirt. How you do it is up to you. So, first big decision. You want to talk them off their land, or you want to wipe them out? Ooh. Get a gang together. Those settlers are as good as dead. Ha, <laughs> 
Stick with the classics. Now, once you and the crew have cleaned the place out, those lucky girls and boys will move in and start working the place. Of course, every outpost you claim for a gang is going to be something the other gangs don't have. And none of them like the thought of their rivals getting a leg up on them. Worth thinking over as you dole out more territory. So, which gang you want to join you on the job? the pack. Sure, sure. I'll get a stake on a string or something. That just leaves the target. Now for a new outpost, you'll usually want to target a spot with plenty of populated settlements nearby that might be able to feed our people later on. Taffington Boathouse, Croup Manor, Greentop Nursery, The Slog all had a good number of farms within striking distance last I checked. Though I'll need to go through my notes again make sure they're all still good to target. We're not always going to be able to run every job against every settlement. So, you ready to pick the spot for Nuka World's first new homestead? I'm ready. Good. So, where do you want to hit? I'm trying to think of places that are... Is Sanctuary on here? No. Uh... Let's hit the slog. Let me... Yep, that place will do. So, these sorts of jobs are pretty straightforward. Move in, kill everything in sight. Be a couple of our guys waiting for you when you arrive. Help you clean the place out. Now, you're not going to be able to take a direct route to the place. Fast way to get yourself killed. So you'll have to meet our folks outside town. Wouldn't be surprised if some Minutemen showed up to lend a hand. Wish I could see their faces when they see who they're going up against. Now, if you're looking for something to give you an extra edge, might be worth checking in with some of the gang bosses. <laughs> Probably got some trick or two up their sleeves. The crew that's joining you is just gonna have standard kits though. If you wanna arm them up differently, I'd take along some extra gear. Knock him dead, boss. Seems like the work never ends. But I'll get it done somehow. I think Mason is the Isn't Mason the guy that's in charge of the pack? I've missed a chance at a rare rifle as well from Mason. Mason, if you use all the threatening dialogue on him, apparently you can get. Someone was telling me apparently you can get like a really good gun. Obviously, I don't have that because I didn't do that. <laughs> I didn't threaten him. Excuse me, boss. Let's chat. Shank says you might need our help vacating the squatters living in our new digs. And ain't it just your lucky day? Wait till you see what I got. I found some toys, a couple operators left on their corpses in the back alley. I'm not sure how they got themselves dead like that. I took them apart and made a little something different out of the parts. It was just gonna be a boy for my pets, but it's more useful than that. Beasts find these things irresistible. Toss them on the ground, and anything nearby and hungry will come a running, ripping anything in their path to pieces. But uh, you're gonna want to be a safe distance away. Because, well, things are a little. Don't want to end up becoming a snack yourself. Oh, right, and here, take this paper. We'll show you how to make more. Don't look so surprised. We ain't all knuckle draggers. It's impressive, Mason. <laughs> ain't it, though? Don't forget where you got those. And when you're putting that to good use, go to your haunts. Don't forget us, all right? Well, it just so happens that the first one is going to be yours, and I better agree. Nice. Right. Out we go. Fast travel. This is going. I'm, I'm actually going to enjoy this. I genuinely am. Uh, this has just given me lots more to do in the game. 
pack's just going to have standard gear, but I'm not really that bothered about that because the pack are. You've got some kind of death wish? Oh, it's you. Hey, just wanted to say no hard feeling. All right? It's okay. I get it. Thank God. If it's any consolation, I'm glad you made it. I don't have any family. Living family. I lost them when Coulter and his gangs took this place from us. Now, these traitors are all I have left. They're my family now. Every time Coulter sent me out to lure people into the gauntlet, I didn't have a choice. I had to do it. Or he'd kill someone I cared about. I'm just... Sorry you had to get caught up in all this. It's all right, Harvey. I understand. Good to hear, boss. Never figured I'd find myself in this situation before. I thought for sure I'd be a goner. Well, better get back to it. Fooling around when you don't belong is a good way to start a fight. I was tempted to go in and see if I could buy uh, one of the disciples' knives, but you know what? Screw it. I'm not gonna. Uh, let's fast travel to... Green Top Nursery is the closest bit. Because we can't fast travel directly to this log. I, th I take it once I start doing this, the Minutemen are just going to be like, you know what? Get out. I'm thinking that in terms of role playing, Intruder, identify yourself. this kind of makes sense because. I would be embittered by, like, my character would be quite bitter about losing his whole family, his wife getting murdered, and then he's basically erased his son and his faction, and, and that's had some psychological effects. So finding raiders has given him a real, uh... <coughs> Scope the settlement out, boss. Those fools are already dead. Just don't know it yet. We're gonna do this or what? Let's get this show on the road. Yeah. I got the slogs in quite a good place as well. Something's coming. I heard that.
Build your gang signal flag. Nice. Where's the workshop? I've just went full on radar, I don't care. Ah, uh, it'll be under radar, won't it? That's operator stuff. Might as well. What am I building again? Build your gang's signal flag. Signal flag the pack. There we go. Oh, this is gonna be fun. Shit's got ambush all over it. Yeah? Place ain't too bad. We gotta get supplies coming in. Head back and tell them we're good to go here. I think Preston now hates me. <laughs> Can you check how liked or disliked you are? No. Not really. That's a bit of a shame. You used to be able to do that in one of the old. Hate beds for 12 people. Hey! Back we go to Nuka World. That was good fun, actually. If that's what we're doing, I might just turn the wasteland into a radar haven. Well, well. Word going around is there's some new raider boss tearing up the commonwealth. <laughs> Not too shabby. I'll make sure your cut of any caps the outpost pulls in are waiting in your quarters. So, now that we got part one on the books, we can move on to part two, provisions. If you want to hang on to this newfound territory, you're going to need to convince a nearby settlement to start handing over shipments of supplies. I'll make sure those shipments get distributed direct to the outpost. Any caps they provide will be waiting in your trunk up in Fiztop. And the more a settlement produces for itself, the more of each we can get them to cough up. Now. Like before, the method's up to you. You can try talking to them yourself, convince them to hand over the goods, or you and a crew can introduce some bullets to some kneecaps. Kneecaps? Meet bullets. <laughs> Sounds good. I'll make sure everyone knows this is a maiming job. So, which gang you want to back you up? The Disciples. Sounds like a plan. 
then all that's left is the target. Only wrinkle is that it's got to be near our crew's new outpost. No settlement's just gonna hand over goods if there's no one close by to follow up on threats. And if you ever want to see for yourself which settlements are within range of our outpost, you can check the map in your pit boy. Joint called Nordhagen Beach, I think, is close enough to work. Could be a good target, though I'd need to check my notes, of course. So, what's the target? Uh, I'd have thought County Crossing was better. Yeah, I just thought. Hmm. Wait. Pretty sure that place is one of yours, boss. That's where you want to hit? Does that matter? Only if you want to keep control of it. Targeting a settlement for a job is going to break whatever connections you might have had to the place. Worth taking a moment to consider how much you like having that spot under your thumb. So, that the target? Yeah. That one's the target. Of course, boss. Now, forcing a place to turn over provisions ain't complicated. Beat the locals so bad they don't want to fight anymore. Put any backup they might have called in, in the dirt. Your crew will be waiting when you get there. I'll remind them not to kill the goods. Expect we'll have a new meal ticket in no time. Oh, I have well and truly bought into the the guy, the raider lifestyle. We've went from being a minute man and being like a hero to now being like a oh, punch. Can I, in fact, unequip weapons? No, I take it I have to do that in the in the pit boy menu. I'll need to uh, work on that. See an outpost range. Where's the nice? So they can hit coastal cottage. So from here, coastal cottage, Finch Farm, County Crossing, Green Top Nursery. Taffington Boathouse and Outpost of Jonah are all in. That's quite a lot of turf, to be fair. I haven't done the National Guard training ground either. That's maybe a little bit of a problem if that's where I'm meeting my disciple crew. Yeah, it looks like it is. Oh no. Get up. Get up. Hey there. Hey boss. We're ready to terrify these settlers into submission and carve up their friends. Just let us know when you want to begin. Let's do this. With pleasure. What does it say? Cripple the settlers, kill the backup. Nice. Got company. Oh, you win. 
wonder if I can how do I melee again? That's oh, R1 in it. Where's the settlement's leader or is it this guy that I knocked out over here? You. You're gonna start supplying Nuka World. Understand? Alright, alright. We'll send whatever you want. Just leave us alone. I take it I can no longer use the workshop here. Yeah, because I'm not allied to the settlement, that makes sense. I kind of like this solution actually because it means I don't have to micromanage all the settlements. <laughs> How wrong is that? I guess we'll just have to let them know who they're dealing with. You did good. Now get going. The adults are gonna discuss this. Figure this would happen sooner or later. Our outposts caught the attention of some of our new neighbors in the Commonwealth. An outside crew of raiders think we're honing in on their territory. Sounds like they're planning to tear the place up, and our people with it. Suppose this provides us a good opportunity to make an example. You thinking what I'm thinking? I will rip them to shreds personally. Bingo. Only language raiders in the Commonwealth understand. Force. But you should probably get going. You wouldn't want to keep our new friends waiting. Wouldn't be neighborly. I wish there was a better way to fast travel back. Because obviously from the Commonwealth I can pretty much fast travel to here, but I have to fast travel back to the Commonwealth. I wish there was a way to like switch map. Why are you stuck in the swimming pool? Excuse me. Good. You're here. Spotted those dogs? Not far off? Hmm, things are about to get fun around here. We are... Who's in charge around here? I'll tear their heart out. Sinner wasn't that great, to be honest. Yeah, that, that, that was fairly easy. Oh, I'm going to have the Commonwealth under the, under the, the Nuka World's thumb completely. Like, that's not even funny. Who 
heard some rumbles, this one didn't get you either. Figure I shouldn't be surprised. Those raiders won't be causing us any more problems. That's what I've been hearing. So I suppose your recent success brings us to the next step. Loyalty. Without loyalty, everything that's yours ain't. And to keep a crew loyal, you need to keep them happy. Now, keeping raiders happy isn't real hard. Just have to make sure they've got their basic necessities. Just like any other settlement. That they've got some things to keep them entertained. And that their food's taken care of. Which, with raiders, well, isn't like dealing with other settlements. Now, if you want me to go into detail on any of that, you just say. What can you tell me about entertainment for the outpost? Well, it's a damn handy way to keep folks distracted if you're lacking in certain basics. Constructing pick-me-up stations or getting one of your crew working on a booze still will certainly help lift your outpost's <laughs> spirits. And if the place has got a Nuka World transmitter powered up, you can construct amplifiers to help as well. Anything else I can answer for you? Tell me more about providing food for the outpost. So, managing your outpost's food can get a little tricky. No one ever joined a crew to dig in the dirt. So you'll want to make sure you've convinced enough settlements to supply your gang. People at the outpost can farm in a pinch, but they sure as hell won't be happy about it. Now, if you're ever wondering if your outpost has enough food, you should take a look in your pip boy. It ought to have a page that'll show you everything your outpost currently needs, food included. If they're low on grub, it's probably time to get a new settlement supplying you. Or you could always drop some food direct in their workshop if it comes to it. Now, was there something else? I want to know more about managing the outpost's basic necessities. Day-to-day -day needs. They're pretty straightforward. Just need to make sure you've set up solid defenses. Plenty of beds under cover, and enough clean water to go around. Not much more to it than that. Was there anything else? I think I've got everything I need to know. Sure. If you've ever got more questions, you come find me. Or you can always consult that pit boy on your arm. No better tool to tell you what your outpost may be hurting for. Now, depending on the state of the place when you hit it, this first outpost might already have some of the bare bones set up. All you've got to do is build up what's missing. If you want to run some jobs to convince more settlements to start sending supplies, well, you know how this works. You just come talk to me. And I was thinking, with the outpost coming as far as it has, might be time I set up shop there. Save you a trip anytime you want to run a job. You just let me know if that's something that'd interest you. Be good to make some trouble in the Commonwealth again. So, there anything I can do? I want you to head to an outpost. Sure thing, boss. Where am I going? Suppose I better get a move on then. See you there, boss. Right, so let's 100% this if we can. So we've got this slog. Data. Slog. So the slog doesn't have defense. That's what's bothering them. Right. Suppose that makes sense, doesn't it? Because raiders need to feel safe because they know they're going to constantly be under attack. If I take that, I can break it down. Uh, if I can find a... Yeah, here we go. Yeah, there should be enough materials for me to work with here. Hey, Shank. Boss, 
What can I do for you? Looking to run a job. Yeah, yeah. What kind of job we talking here? Put the word out. Me and a crew are gonna convince some settlers we... to start paying up. You got it, boss. And which gang you want to join you on the job? The Disciples. Done. So, where you want to do this? Green Top Nursery was in reach, so we might as well do that. Hmm. Huh. I think that one's your territory, boss. You're sure that's the one you want to hit? That one's the target. <laughs> Ruthless. Which brings us to the plan. Beat the fight out of the local citizenry, kill anyone dumb enough to try to defend them. Your crew will be waiting when you get there. I'll remind them not to kill the goods. Watch yourself out there. Will do. Where am I going? Over there. It's not that far away to be fair. What I need... Still, pick me up station. Nah, no, you, you don't have to do it, my man. You can get to work on the booze. That needs two power. Can I even build? A generator. Yeah, I can. We got. So that's that radar outpost happy. Now it's time to go and make nearby settlers deeply unhappy. <laughs> The Minutemen are going to absolutely despise me, having spent so long building them. <laughs> oh. I've basically come to the Commonwealth to take them apart again. I've went full Negan. All quiet, General. Is it? <laughs> <laughs> the hall won't be your general much longer. Hmm, let's do this. Told you. Oh dear. I wonder how long it'll be before Preston turns up and he's like, What are you doing? Everything we built up together. Maybe I should just go speak to him and then kill him. Bit bloodthirsty. Hey there. Hey boss. We're all set. No dead settlers, huh? <sighs> Pity. Good thing everyone else is fair game. You ready? Let's do this. With pleasure.
going to give me and my gangs back in Nuka World everything we ask for. Got it? Yeah, yeah, sure. You'll get your supplies, all right? Jesus. <laughs> so... The slog... Postal Cottage... Troop Manor... That's Nortagen Beach. Yeah, Nortagen Beach is, in its, is within its reach, like... Okay. Seems a bit weird to me that it's there, but well, oh, this is going to be so much fun. I cannot wait. I'm going to enjoy this. Let the bad side out for a play. Place is looking good, boss. Everything a gang of low lives could ask for. So, you ready for the final piece of the puzzle? <laughs> ready as I'll ever be. Good to hear. Because what you've made is a foothold. To solidify our place, our outfit's gonna need some real numbers. Two more outposts carved from the Commonwealth ought to do the trick. Get all that together, and <laughs> well. We'll have a real base of power on our hands. With that kind of clout, we'll be able to start setting up dealers at our outposts. Get to selling stuff like real damn towns. We keep expanding from there. We'll even be able to set up spots where the locals can come drop off tribute. But I'm getting ahead of myself. For now, you'll want to start by claiming another two outposts. You just let me know whenever you want to get rolling on those jobs. So, boss. What's the plan? Was hoping you could arrange a job for me. Works for me. What type of job did you want to run? It's time we took over another settlement. And did you want to talk the settlers off their land yourself? Or should I rally some bodies to help you put them on ice? Get a gang together. I want a clean house. Sure, sure. In which gang you want to join you on the job? The Disciples. Can do. So, where do you want to hit? Oberlin Station. Let me... Oh, that place. Isn't that one of your old stomping grounds? Sure that's the one? That one's the target. Just wanted to make sure. So you know how this job works. Head to the target, put down anything that moves. I'll send a crew ahead to the settlement. They'll help you clear the place out. Take down any backup these folks managed to convince to throw in with them. Show those settlers who's in charge. <laughs> If I travel to Grey Garden, then I can just travel across the bridge. Yep, here we go. Oh, I do like to be a raider. There's less micromanagement involved, though, because raiders can be left to just amuse themselves. Like, if you just build those three basics, it seems to really boost the... the happiness. And they're just like, yeah, all right, fair enough. We've got drugs, we've got food, we've got water. We're happy. I'll need to decorate them. I'll be doing some uh, in-between stuff probably 
and I'll do some decorating. Uh, make them look more like radar outposts than nice cheery cheery. Hey, got a good look at them, boss. We're all ready to carve up these idiots and their little friend. Want to move in? Let's get this show on the road. Hell yeah. I like that handgun she's got. How do I get me one of them? These are the disciples. I can repair this and it will work for me. <laughs> Nice. Perfect. Stick a booze still here and find you are on that. You are on that. The irony of what I'm going to do next, because I think the next settlement is going to be a bun <laughs> farm who lost a daughter to raiders and I'm pretty much going to turn up on their doorstep and go Nope <laughs> Hey Shaq Hey boss, just one more outpost to claim You want me to set up that job, you just say So, what do you need? I'm interested in running a job you got it. Just need the details. What job you looking to run? A new outpost. I want to get one set up. Sure thing, boss. You gonna talk to them yourself? Or should I get a crew to help you put them in the dirt? Start organizing a crew. We're gonna bury those settlers. I'll make it happen. And which gang you want to join you on the job? The operators. I'll let them know. So, what's the target? Hmm. Somerville Place. Sunshine Titans Cops. Yeah, I've fortified a lot of these. <laughs> Could do Jamaica Plain. Let me... Oh, that place. Isn't that one of your old stomping grounds? I'm sure that's the one. That one's the target. Of course, boss. So you know how this job works. Head to the target, put down anything that moves. I'll send a crew ahead to the settlement. They'll help you clear the place out. Take down any backup these folks managed to convince to throw in with them. Knock him dead, boss. 
Literally. That'll get me the three settlements, but of course not all of them will be happy, happy, happy settlements. Uh, Shaw High School is going to be the best place to go. <clears throat> so in between, we'll redecorate these so that people know that they belong to me. And we'll also get all the settlements we can, supplying them with food. I think I'm actually going to really enjoy <laughs> doing this. That's sick. I quite like being the bad guy. Like, I, I'm not a bad guy in real life. My wife would be the first person to tell you that, but in video games I don't mind, like, playing the villain. Absolutely not. I'll quite happily play the outlaw in Red Dead Redemption 2 or Renegade in Mass Effect. Hey. Scouted them out, boss. Seems they brought in some muscle. Just means more fun to go around. Time for us to move in? Is there anything I should know about the place we're about to hit? Seems pretty straightforward. We live, they all die. Now, time we get started. Let's get this show on the road. Hell yes. I never liked the Institute anyway. Can I stim pack you or are you just gonna sit there? Oh no, there we go, you're up. Into the radar bit. Get the operator's flag planted. Get me a new rank of the Wasteland Warlord perk. You can build radar dealers at your outposts. Nice. Is within reach of this settlement, Jamaica Plain, Warwick Homestead. Think I will 
hit the Warwick homestead myself and get them to supply. Can I do that? Can can I just turn up at a settlement and say No. I have to actually run a job. Right, okay. Right, let's go talk to Shank then, because I want to... I think I'll finish this episode just by doing some basics. Uh... I don't think that's doing anything, is it? This won't work without power. There's two. Why are there two? Power generator. So we are going to get a main mission before. I should have probably handed the first three territories to the pack, but... Where is the power plant that I need to get to? It's up here, I haven't been to it yet. Uh, if I travel here, I should just be able to jog up the last bit of the map. Yeah, let's go. That'll be the power plant there then. and they're going to be in that little concrete bunker waiting for me. No, no. Damn, I thought... Oh, no, they are. Both of you shut up. We're about to find out. The boss is here. Mason's gathered up his animal goons and took the power plant. That asshole thinks he'll get away with this. He's dead wrong. I'll skin him alive and savor every minute of it. God damn it. 
it. Sometimes I swear this is like taking care of a bunch of children. I'm going to pretend I didn't hear that, because we've got bigger problems. While you were gone, word came back from the Commonwealth that you're favoring the Disciples and the Operators. Well, surprise, surprise, Mason wasn't exactly thrilled to hear the news. He and his gang forced their way into the power plant. Now they've got the entire place locked down. We can't let him get away with this, boss. And we all want to crack at those loonies. Damn right we do. Look, it's your play. We'll follow you anywhere. But you have to swear to us that Mason pays for this with his life. He's as good as dead. Music to my ears. Time to clean house. We got your back, boss. On the plus side, these guys should have 7.62 rounds on them. Which will come in handy. Nice. Nice. Oh, cleaning house. There's nothing like cleaning house. Let's get these guys rinsed. This is going to be the last action of this episode as well, is cleaning, is literally cleaning up all these gits. Nice guys. How are we getting in there? Have I missed something somewhere? Oh no, it's down here. Ah, oh, right, down and down, right, okay.
Nice. Out the pack. The pack were my least favourite gang anyway. I really didn't like them. That's wonder good. <laughs> Always need the adhesive. I'm gonna have to sellotape my armor back together after this. What's in there? Is that power armor? Ooh, that's a full suit of cool power armor. Sometimes you get quite a lot of these and you can do, I think I did it on a, the previous episode where I literally had one uh, option to guess, so it wasn't really a guess, basically I had one option to pick. The doorway has a likeness of one, crowbar has a likeness of two. Shadows, no. Showing, there we go. This is a full suit of XO1 Mark III. Nice. That, that is pretty awesome. I need to remember that's there. That'll save me going back for the full suit that's in. Commonwealth, there's a full suit you can get. Well, I guess the pack have been taught a lesson. <laughs> Where's the the rest of my crew? If this is just another damn prank, I'm gonna die. I'm stuck on something there that I couldn't see. Uh take all the ammo. Want anything else of him? Get the quantum. Excellent. Take the new cup power recipe. Ah, oh, yeah, I love that. Unlock the safe for.